We surely aren't staying in this inn, are we? Why not? Tom recommended it. I thought we might see about staying with some of the Bree hobbits. It'd be more home-like. Oh, Sam. This is as good as an inn back home. Just a lot larger. The larger the inn, the larger the meals. Don't worry, Sam. This will be fine. Maybe Sam can find a tater patch to sleep in. I'll make arrangements with the innkeeper while you three find something to eat. And remember, from now on, my name is Mr. Underhill. Right. Come on, Sam. Pippin. Uh, goodbye, Mr. Underhill. to give you a word of advice, young hobbit. Oh? There are some dangerous folks about tonight. I hope you stay safe. I'm sure I will. So do I. Enjoy your stay. I'm glad to see that you are safe. I'm glad... Oi! What do you want, fatty? Excuse me? Why don't you go stand by the fire with the rest of the children? Bill Fernie's trying to relax. You again? Be off with you before I feed you to my dogs, pesky rodent. You again. I don't like you hobbits much. Go away. I don't like... Hello there. Nolly, at your service. Pleased to meet you. My name is Underhill. And how do you find Bree, Underhill? Is it to your liking? It is pleasant enough. Though it isn't the Shire. Or the kingdom under the mountain, I'll wager. You know of Erebor? How I miss my distant home. Soon I shall return there. Once my business in the West reaches its conclusion, I will be glad to be among my folk again. Good fortune to you, Nolly. And to you, good Underhill. May your shire be ever green and fair. Lonely Mountain calls to me. Erebor, Erebor. Soon I shall walk through your hallowed halls again. I still don't like the look of this place. We'll be gone soon enough, Sam. Don't worry. That is my worry if you follow me, sir. We'll be gone. Gone for good. What kind of a cook doesn't put taters in the stew? It's no stew at all without taters, my old gaffer liked to say. We should have come here long ago. Good food, an excellent drink. Don't get too comfortable. Things could change. I'll worry about that when the time comes. Until then, I shall rest my weary feet and enjoy the local hospitality. Imagine, hobbits and big folk getting along in one village. Pleased to meet you. My name is Underhill. Is this your first time in an inn, Mr. Underhill? No. That is to say, it's my first time in this inn. <laughs> I see. Well, if you're planning on staying here, you should check with the innkeep. Wait too long and you'll be sleeping in the stables. Right. Thank you for the advice. Hello. I'd like to... Half a minute, if you please. Nob, where are you? With customers. Step lively. Now then, good evening, little master. Balaman Butterbur at your service. What may you be wanting? Room for four, please. You're from the Shire, from the Sandia. We don't get many from the Shire nowadays. Shire. Now, what does that remind me of? 
Might I ask your name? Mr. Underhill. I'm run off my feet with all these travellers tonight. There's a crowd in the house tonight as there hasn't been in long years. Lucky you're a hobbit. That's the only kind of room we have left. Here's your key then. Nob! Nob, you woolly-footed slow coach. Where are you? Here, sir. Here I am. Where's Bob? Find him double sharp. He's got some ponies to stable straight away. I'll get right on it, sir. You'll excuse me, sir, but I've a party of dwarves to tend to and all these strangers coming up the greenway from the south. Busy days, these. Ever. Fireworks that only a wizard could make. <laughs> oh, Bilbo starts a long, boring speech, but he has a trick up his sleeve. <laughs> or in his pocket. Mr. Underhill, I'd ever. stop your friend from talking if I were you. <laughs> so Bilbo says to the 144 <laughs> hobbits at the party, you are one gross of hobbits. <laughs> Everyone's so offended, they don't see his hand go into his pocket. You'd better do something <laughs> so quick. People of Bree, thank you for your gracious reception. <laughs> Let's have a song. And wait, 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 I'm getting to the good part. Very well, then. A song. There is an inn, a merry old inn, beneath an old grey hill. And there they make us do so brown that the man in the moon himself flew down at night to eat his fill. Uh, uh, oh. Where did he go? Sorcery! Bah. Conjurer's trick, that's all. <laughs> right, and a fine trick it was. What you did was worse than anything your friend could have said. It was an accident. I want a word with you somewhere quiet. Hello. Who are you? Uh, what do you want? I am called Strider. And if what I say is helpful to you, I want you to take me with you. I would not agree to any such thing until I knew a lot more about you. Excellent. You seem to be coming to your senses again after your accident. Begging your pardon, I need a word. Everyone in this place needs a word. I remembered what it was I forgot. What? About a shire hobbit named Baggins, but called Underhill. Who told you this? Gandalf the wizard. He asked me to send this letter to you in the shire, but I forgot. I expect he'll turn me into a block of wood. Dear Frodo, bad news. You must leave for Rivendell before the end of July. Do not wait for your birthday. I will meet you if I can, or follow you if I can. You can trust the ranger called Strider, but make sure he's the real Strider. His true name is Aragorn. I am Aragorn, son of Arathorn. And if by life or death I can save you, I will. I thought I would have to persuade you without proof, but my looks are against me. I believed you. Or I wanted to. The enemy spies look fair but feel foul. While you feel fair... But look foul. <laughs> um, hold on. Where's Mary? He's still not back from his walk. Stay here. I'll find him. Sorry, sir. The stables are all closed off. I got to get him clean before the boss has my hide.
What do you want, Longshanks? None of your concern, horse thief. What? You gonna call me a horse thief? I already have. Now be gone. You've stuck your nose in the wrong place. I've seen you talking to the Shire Axe. You want the reward for baggins all to yourself. But you won't get it. doing out here? That's my business. It's my business now. You'll beg to tell me after my friends work you over. There you are, Mary. Who are you? They call me Strider. I am a friend of Gandalf. Very well, friend. What should we do now? Return to the inn and find your friends. Tell Butterbur to lodge you in my quarters. What about you? I think it's time to throw these enemies off the scent. Beg your pardon? I'm going to collect some items to make decoys of you hobbits. You'll see. You must come with me. I'll see you safely back to the inn. I do appreciate it. These streets have suddenly become rather unfriendly. Come along. Woo! <laughs> 
my decoys convincing arms and legs in the dark. I doubt the gatekeeper will miss them. These rags will make my decoys more convincing. Melons will make fine substitutes for hobbit heads. They will break convincingly in the dark. Talk, you little mouse. Talk or I'll make you squeak. I don't know, no baggins. I swear it. Little mousey's about to get his airy foot in a rat trap. Bold words for a filthy orc son of Mordor. Ah, I'll make you squeak too, wanderer. safer quarters. There may be more of those men about. Right you are, sir. Them dirty horse stalls can wait. Say, this has been... I can barely keep my eyes open. Black Riders, I hope this plan works. You should sleep, all of you. I'll keep watch in the night. We leave at dawn. Where will we go? Toward Rivendell. But not by the main road. Ah, I should have known. More shortcuts and long delays. The last time we tried that, we were almost eaten by a tree. My shortcuts don't go wrong. Early the next morning, I led the four hobbits safely out of Bree and into the troll-haunted wilderness beyond. We approached the hill that the elves call Amon Sul and that men call Weathertop.
Strider, what's that light? I'm not certain. It's too distant to make out. But it appears to be coming from Weathertop. It's like lightning. We'll know more once we reach Weathertop. We need to reach Weathertop's summit quickly. If Gandalf is following, he'll go there to look for us. We might find Gandalf there. The hope is faint. And he's even less likely to find us on the paths I take through the wilderness. Perhaps the Black Riders won't find us in the wilderness either. Frodo, Samwise, come with me. Lead the way, Aragorn.
great struggle took place within them. Look at this cairnstone. There are runes on it. It appears to be a G and a 3. G for Gandalf. And the 3 might mean a date. October 3rd was not long ago. Gandalf was here. If he was, he left in a hurry. Perhaps he ran into trolls. Or worse. <laughs> Look, down there, on the Great East Road. Dark Riders! <sighs> Merry and Pippin are down there. Back to the camp, quickly! Protect him. 